In two-way girls basketball, Wyoming Indian was one of the best. 24 wins this season with two six-game win streaks and a nine-game winning streak. They were a number one seed entering the 2A state tournament. And first off, they pulled off a 53-42 win over Wright. Scoring machine Amarin Brown at 20 points and Morning Gambler at 18. The Lady Chiefs won this despite 32% shooting from the field. So that victory put them in the 2A semifinals versus defending state champion Pine Bluffs. The Lady Chiefs played an excellent second quarter and came out on top 56-49. Once again, Wyoming Indians shot 32% from the floor and were led in scoring by Brown and gambler with 15 each. The Lady Chiefs did connect on seven three-pointers for the second straight game. So into the finals they go to take on Bighorn. A late defensive stand by Bighorn gave the Rams the state title 50-49. to The Lady Chiefs were 1 of 10 from three-point land and shot 37% from the floor. Amarin Brown was just playing sensational with 30 points on 10 of 17 from the field and 10 of 20 from the line. Brown for the season averaged 17 points a game and was named All-State for the third time in her career. Morning Gambler was a double-digit score with 11, so she made All-State. Looking ahead to next year, the Lady Chiefs will need to find some offense as Brown and Gambler were seniors. Shoshana Norris, Jolie Trosper, and Jada Antelope were also seniors. But Alexandria Trosper, who averaged 10 points a game, was just a sophomore this past season.